Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video I'm going to be doing a haul. I've been ordering a couple things offline and I just wanted to haul them for you guys. You know, I've been collecting these things for like maybe a little over a month or two and they've all come in and I've had this really big pile by my door that, you know, my mother wasn't very fond of. So I'm just going to go ahead and do this haul and so if you're interested in seeing that, just keep watching. So the first thing, I'm going to start with Forever 21. I usually, I don't really shop in Forever 21 very often, but I did pick up a couple pieces. I, it was like two shirts I picked up. And the first one is this honey shirt. And it looks like this. It was $10. It's super soft. Um, they originally, this shirt comes um, from Fashion Nova, as many of you guys probably have seen. It's been a very, it's been a very popular shirt that everybody and their grandma has had on the internet. And it was on Fashion Nova, and I was originally going to get it from them, but when I zoomed in on the picture on Fashion Nova, it was like way too see-through, and it wasn't really that good quality. But anywho, the next thing I picked up was this floral top, Hawaiian-esque type thing. It was super cute when I saw it online. It was like this little brown girl. She had it on. She was about my skin tone and she had it on. It looked really nice and it complimented her skin really well. So of course I had to add it to my shopping cart. It's cute. It's cute. And I'm interested to see how this one wears. And I think that's all I got from Forever 21. So next store I'm going to talk about is Levi's. And I love Levi's. Like I, I give most of my jeans from there. It's either Levi's or American Eagle. But Levi's always fit me super well. They just, they're super comfortable and I just love them. So the first pair of jeans that I have are these 501 fit. I got a size 28. These are the 501 jeans for women, straight leg, button fly. And they have this little patch right here, which is so cute because it matches some shoes that I just bought, which I'll show that later on in the video. But uh, these are super cute and I got them on sale. I paid $14 for these jeans, I believe. But these are the black pair jeans that I've got, that I got from Levi's. These are the vintage wedgie fit and they're high rise and slim through the hip and thigh. These were, I forget how much these were, they were like $15, $20 as well. And I got them in black because they ran out of my size in the blue color, which I thought was super cute, but you know, I was determined to have a pair of wedgie fit jeans because I've been seeing these online everywhere and they look so cute on everybody and I was just like, I gotta get a pair. So I got these in a size 27 and I'm excited to wear them. Honestly, I only bought most of these clothes because I am going to Coachella and I'm probably just going to end up wearing all these clothes to Coachella unless, you know, the spirit moves me to do otherwise, but as of right now, this is what I'm wearing. The next item I have is not a clothing item, it's a fanny pack that I got. It's from Adidas and it's in this cute yellow color, it's like a giant banana really, and I can put it on, I mean, who wears fanny packs like this, but it buckles like this. Come on, just when I want to demonstrate. Well, there's that. So it clips like this, but it buckles, it's cute, and it's sizable. Love it. I paid way too much for it, honestly. It was $24, and I really could have gone to Walmart and gotten a regular fanny pack, but it's got a, a decent amount of space for all the things I'm going to put, my phone, my portable chargers, some chapstick, and it's got this mini pocket in here too. It's just super cute. And it, the, it feels very firm and durable, which is what I like because I keep my stuff until the end of time. I do not get rid of things, not because I'm a hoarder, but because I like to wear it out until it's absolutely damaged and cannot be worn anymore. And the final item that I have is a portable charger. This is the charger that I have, and you can see the little charging point right here. It's for my iPhone 6. I got it off of Amazon. It was $13. I got this for Coachella because I can't be out there with a dead phone. I just... Who does that? And this is for me to capture all my memories without running out of battery power. But it just hooks together really simply. But I just stick my phone in the case and snap it in. And voila. And it even has like this little kickstand if I want to like chill and prop my phone up and watch something. This is a 3500mAh and the iPhone holds about 3200mAh. I'm not sure what that stands for, but I know that's the battery capacity and I did my research on that. But yeah, so I have the phone case and I also have this portable battery. I'm not really sure what its capacity is. Oh, this one has 2200. So I have, then I got this portable charger 
This has 4,000 power and it's a nice rose gold color. Super cute, I got it for TJ Maxx and it was $10. And this is what it looks like. I haven't taken it out the packaging yet, but I'll get there eventually. I just, one day. And then I also bought another one. This one has 4,400 power charging capacity. And last but not least, I also got a new pair of shoes. I bought these Vans. These are the denim patchwork Vans slip-ons. And I thought they were so cute online. These are a size six and a half. The shoes are actually comfortable by themselves, but I just need something to fill up a little space right here so I'm not like loosey-goosey and somebody, you know, just my luck, I'll be walking somewhere, somebody will step on the back of my shoe and, you know, whoop, my whole foot is out and I just, I can't. But yeah, so those are all the items that I got. These are actually my favorites. But these are all the items that I picked up and this is the end of my haul. And if you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe.